If you think about the phone you use to the car that you drive in, to all the infrastructure, roads and buildings, all of those things you can equate back to engineers. When I think of engineering and how important it is, you can't think of a single product that's out there right now that an engineer didn't touch. I think in general we just need more engineers in Wisconsin and if I look at it just from a Plexus perspective, there's a strong need just from us as being one company and when you look at the ability of engineers to be able to create and create jobs and to do that across a multitude of companies. Engineering is critical to make our economy grow. The University of Wisconsin-Madison sets the standard for engineering in our state. Other universities look up to it. It's like a beacon of how to run a strong engineering program. We can't grow our company without continuing to innovate and develop new technologies, and we have to have more UW-Madison engineers coming in to help us do that. When I talk to the recruiting companies as they come here, all of them say, we can go anywhere and get good engineers. We come to UW-Madison to get great engineers because we know they're well-educated, they know how to work in teams, they know how to break down a, a problem and solve it. My name is Andrea Grimaldo Moreno. I am a junior studying mechanical engineering. I am mechanical engineering, but I do hope to work in a more of a medical devices, biotechnology sort of setting. I see it as a way of knowing that whatever I produce or whatever I work on is impacting someone or something directly. To be from the edge. Currently, if you look at last year's data for enrollments, we had over 7,000 applications to the College of Engineering. We were able to take 1,100 undergraduates into the college. Clearly, we need to be able to take more students. We don't have the capabilities today to meet the demand, and we're only able to do that with a, with a new facility. And that will generate more opportunities for Wisconsin industries to hire our students. If we don't stay competitive with new facilities, it's going to be harder for us to attract the quality of faculty that we're known for and enable us to teach the students and conduct the research. Getting a new building in the College of Engineering campus is absolutely essential. 